he has become my obsession, man. <laughs> you know, he has become my obsession. I want it worse than the fans want it now. Believe me. When's the last time? When's the last time you've talked to his management? When's the last time what? You've talked to his management. <laughs> More recent than you would think. <laughs> Listen, it's no different than you know. And any guy who's who's considered, you know, one of the best in the world, I, you know, we want, and I talk to guys every day, and they're no different. Just because, you know, we've had some, uh, I wouldn't call it bad blood, but you know, we just had some, you know, I talk some smack about them, they talk some smack about me. It doesn't mean that uh, that we can't get deals done. Fedor, if he has a contract with them in some manner, you know, I know he signed something, isn't it like tortious interference to talk to him yeah. about a contract if he's under a contract? That would be. And I would never interfere with somebody else's contract, so. Okay. So he doesn't have a contract? I mean, you've never, ever, I mean, even think back to the days of Pride or um, Affliction or IFL or any of the millions that have, you know, come and gone. You've never, ever heard of me messing with anybody's fighter or trying to mess with anybody's contract. Mm -hmm. Never. So the fact that you're talking to him would indicate that he doesn't have a contract? It's never happened and it never will. I wouldn't mess with somebody else's contract. Right, so I mean that indicates then that he doesn't have a contract. I don't know. <laughs>